Good morning, Panthers. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Special edition, Spill the Tea. We've got some special guests here today you might recognize. Ms. Torres. And Mr. Langston. And Mr. Langston. I'm Ms. Duclos. And I'm Ms. Dutcher. And this is a super special edition of Spill the Tea. We are going to talk about mental health and wellness today. All right, so mental health and wellness is something that gets talked about quite a bit these days. And it's something that we're going to spend some time on in, during TAP time over the next several days. And we wanted to give you a little intro into why we do that and, uh, and where you can get more information. So, Ms. Torres, why do we do uh, mental health and wellness lessons? Well, just like everyone has physical health, and that's been the topic, obviously, for the past months, it's literally written all over our faces why we're talking about physical health, but sometimes mental health gets pushed to the back. Everyone has mental health. So, we want to make sure that you are aware that mental health is something that we need to talk about. It's usually not brought to your attention until something negatively impacts you. You know you're going through a breakup, you're stressing for a test, um, you have a death in your family. These are all things that are going to affect you mentally and can also affect your physical well-being. So today, we actually are kicking off our mental health awareness education series. You're going to be in your tap, as Ms. Duclos had mentioned, you're going to be watching videos and having these very important discussions. We're super excited. We've watched the videos ourselves many times, and we hope that you find them uplifting and just an easy way to talk about mental health. Because again, I can't stress enough, we all have mental health. And I think some good examples that, that we've talked about over the last couple of days, when you, when you get hurt, you hurt your arm or you hurt your foot, you go to the clinic. Uh, very much like that here at Lucanto High School, we have a lot of resources if you are not feeling well mentally. Um, as Ms. Torres mentioned, if you have a breakup or something else sad that's happened to you, we have people who would love to talk to you. So, um, Mr. Langston, how do I get an appointment if I need to come see someone? Um, you can go into the Panther Zone on, um, on your iPad and you can make an appointment there. It's really simple to do. Um, and you can see all your counselors on there. Ms. Price is actually on there also. And um, you can get transcripts, everything else through there. Um, so it's really easy to do and we really encourage you guys to do that. Um, we're there for mental health also. We're there for you guys to talk to. Just, you just need somebody to vent. That's what we're there for. Um, and, we, and you need to do that. That's part of being healthy and, and, and all of that. So Mr. Langston, what if you're my guidance counselor and I don't feel comfortable talking to you? What should I do? And, and that is absolutely fine. Um, we don't want kids to feel like they have to see somebody. I know there's kids that I have that actually will look up Ms. Torres because they feel a little more comfortable. And we don't have any issues with that. If you don't feel comfortable talking to me, let me know that. Because um, we have done that before. I've had some kids that feel a lot more comfortable talking to Ms. Torres. So just let us know. Um, that's why they're, we all have different personalities and sometimes you're, just, it's, you're gonna get along with somebody a little bit different. Yeah, and keep in mind, you can always talk to one of your teachers too if you feel comfortable and we can refer you to the right person. But mental health is extremely important. All right, guys, well, we wanted to make sure that you were aware of all the resources that are out there. Uh, please take the TAP time seriously and participate with your teacher so that we can all get as much out of this as we possibly can. Hope you have a great day. See you next time. Thank you. Hello, everyone. Welcome to another Good Morning of Motivation. It is... <laughs> Girls Soccer Tryouts start on October 27th. Giving you guys another quote today. So today's quote is kindness in words for that day. Also, you must bring your equipment, water, and water bottles, and mask. Boy soccer tryouts are happening now. Make sure you have all the paperwork turned in before that date. Also, you must bring your equipment, water, 
water bottles, and a mask. Girls basketball tryouts start the 26th. That is next Monday. See Coach Allen for more information. Sean. Boys basketball tryouts start at November 2nd. That's what 11 stands for. Wrestling tryouts start 11-9. Make sure you have completed...